This is where Stephen tells me his exciting plans for the barracks. He plans to turn the top floor into a boutique Airbnb and possibly a wine bar in the middle floor and he's going to turn the sales downstairs into escape rooms. I can't now wait to see whenever this is finished. This would have been the lookout room and uh, this is where the police would have been able to see out onto the street to see what was going on. And uh, here, look at those coke tins. When's the last time you've seen those in the shop? This downstairs um, was like an old staircase underneath the floor to like a wee alley that leads to nowhere. The barracks is listed as being built in 1860 and with some later additions added around 1927. As you can see, the barracks is in its original state and uh, it's really nice to walk around and just to see wee bits and pieces that originated from the time when it was used. Like, look at this old paperwork. So we found a room that has uh, like a planning board up behind me and then on the opposite side of the wall there's a map still up. So it's like the original map that they would have used in the police days. Uh, have a look. These are bomb proof shutters so if there was any bomb attacks or grenades they would have been closed over to protect the people inside. So this is the kitchen and this is where I guess everyone would have ate. Uh, so you can see small signs of where like the stove would have been um, and there's even a weekly menu. No food on it though. This is like a wee uh, pigeonhole cupboard where they would have filed their paperwork. And one which caught my eye was allowing oneself to be carried, but I've been told that that actually means if you are in a vehicle that has been stolen. Who knew? So we have found in one of the rooms, um, it's a document that says Royal Ulster Constabulary, persons on bail reporting to police stations. Um, so it asks for your details to be put in. Obviously, you'd put in the criminal's name, date, where they're being held, etc., and what their crime was. Brilliant. And a photograph would be put here. Amazing. So, there's two cells still left in the police station, and um, this is us in one now. Look at the bars and all in the window, and the bed. The bed that's actually made of concrete not very comfortable but i guess it's not supposed to be brilliant isn't it just love this place it's a nice scary masks thanks to stephen for letting me into photograph and i really enjoyed it and i can't wait to get back to see it when it's finished and guys don't forget to give them a wee follow on instagram